I'm Jody Miller. Let's get started. According to the latest data, America's middle class is in serious decline. So it's like Obama is the Democrat mayor of America. <laughs> New Labor Department statistics show that almost 93 million Americans are no longer working. Wow. If we had $10 for every unemployed American, we could have purchased a non-functioning healthcare website. <laughs> NBC ran a piece on the Today Show endorsing former American Idol loser Clay Aiken for Congress. Experts say Aiken has a good chance, unless his opponent is Ruben Stutter. <laughs> The Washington Post is calling liberal Arkansas Democrat Mark Pryor a, quote, moderate. Well, to be fair to the Washington Post, moderate means that he opposes putting Republicans in jail for their views. <laughs> An NPR business reporter said there's a special place in hell reserved for Donald Trump. NPR liberal listeners were outraged, not about the Trump comment, but because someone at NPR might actually believe in heaven and hell. <laughs> A company in Seattle has come up with a wine glass holder for your shower. Please, I already know about that. I mean, how do you think I get ready to do news busted? <laughs> the New York Times is under fire for running fake stories that are actually advertisements, as opposed to their other fake stories, which are actually campaign ads for Hillary Clinton. <laughs> And finally, child psychiatrists are noting an uptick in children with anxiety about climate change. Some kids are actually suffering from insomnia for fear that Al Gore is hiding underneath their beds. <laughs> Thanks for watching News Buzz, everybody. I'm Jody Miller. Make sure to tell your friends about us, and we'll catch you next time.